Hello, everyone. Welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Through Shining Force 2. It's actually been a long time since I've recorded anything uh, Shining Force 2 related. So, yeah. Well, I finally ran out of backlog video, so I have to record. <laughs> Anyways, in our last episode, we got through a really intense battle um, here in the town of Polka. And we had... Uh, oh, if I can remember the buttons. Gerholt, join us. Uh, he's level 13, decent experience. So we're actually pretty under-leveled for at this point in the game. So we gotta pick up the pace a little bit because we are slacking. Anyways, uh, yeah, so Gerholt joined us. We got into a crazy battle. We barely won, but we survived without any other deaths. And that's all that matters. So now we got this guy, Lucas, following us. Luke. Oh, wait a minute. No! I can't go that way. I have to go up first, and I have to talk to... No, not that guy. Where the hell am I? Where am I going? I gotta go up. Uh, This way. Yes, this way. Please take that boy with you. Okay, let's go, boy. Who are you? Excuse me, but I'm blind. Okay, well... He's blind. Uh, do I leave? No. I'm so confused now. Uh... I thought... Did I break the game? Excuse me. Please take the boy with you. Dad, don't kill me. Please take him. Oh, there you go. Hey, you have to talk to him like five times. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Don't possess me. What's he talking about? I don't know. What a loon. Come on, Mayor. We're alive. What? The Mayor examines Luke carefully. You're warm. You're alive! He just said that. I really regret all of this. Suddenly the devils appeared. We had no power to resist them. Because we are weaklings, they promised they would do nothing if we gave Oddler to them. And you sent me in Oddler's place? <laughs> well, you need a sacrificial lamb once in a while, you know. I'm sorry! What happened? Okay, that's really weird. The game just like instant froze on me for a second. I'm sorry, please don't tell King Bado. Hmm. Alright, I won't. If you prepare a raft for Dario. Oh thank you, a raft. Okay. Hey Ripster. Yes. Prepare a raft for Prince Luke. But it's the last one we have. I don't care. You can make another if necessary, can't you? Yes, sir. All right, we're going to get a raft. A raft will be waiting for you on the river. Why don't you take a look at it right now? Okay. He wants to get rid of us. <laughs> You're right. Anyways, now we have a raft. Let's go. Okay, so now, as we're trying to leave, just a minute, if it's possible, please take this boy with you, you lazy human, you don't want to take care of him. <laughs> you see how it is, he gave us a raft and then I guess I have to take him along. Will you take him with us? Sure. Are you serious? Dario, you're too nice. I know. I know. A lot of people tell me that, but... You know, I feel bad for the blind boy. Adler, Dario will take you. You can trust him. The hell you can. Thank you very much. Great, so now... We're taking a blind boy with us. Watch out, be careful. Yes, I will. I'm Adler. I was nearly dead when I came here. Actually, I don't remember. I don't know the reason why the devils are after me. 
I don't remember anything. I'm afraid I'll cause you a lot of trouble. Dario decides to take Adler with him because he is the nicest guy in the world and if he doesn't take him, no one will. And if no one takes him, then... <sighs> Sorry. Got excited. Alright, now, if we try to leave town... <clears throat> now, let's go to the Devil's Tale to see Creed. It sounds like Luke is going with us. I am! I want to fight with Dario! This might be exciting. Luke the Birdman has joined the force. So, we've been getting just all kinds of characters, and now we got yet another Birdman. So... I didn't know you were such an adventurer. Alright, well, let's go! Let's not go. Because... Um... Okay, so here's Luke, level 14. 26 attack, 18 defense. So his defense is not the greatest. And he's pretty middle run or middle of the mill character. Um, but he has a middle sword. And if I remember, this weapon shop up here has a long sword. So right off the bat, we can pretty much upgrade the weapon. I think by. What do you want to do? Yep, long sword. And Luke. So it's going to take his attack from 26 to 30 attack. Great. What do you want to buy? Nothing else. You want to repair? Oops. Do I need to repair? Actually, while I have the repair button open, do I need to repair the... Not the mithril. Do I need to repair the power ring? No. The power ring did not get damaged amazingly in the last battle. Uh, sell... We will sell Luke's middle sword. All right. And that's pretty much it. So we got a really massive army starting to build here. And now we can continue on with the game, finally. So we have control of the raft. Um, I think, well, let me go to the right first. Rat. Finicky controls. Okay, so that's where we came, I believe. I just want to double check and make sure. But I think this is a dead end, if I'm not mistaken. Yikes. Fin like I said, Finicky. Yeah, see? So that's just a dead end. And there's nothing there to search. Oops. Okay. So, the only way we can really go with the raft is the other way. To the left, to the left. Alright, left up, left right. Okay, so, down this way. And what's over here, first of all? Anything? I forget sometimes, it's like... I don't remember if there's mithril in the area, or anything that we need to be investigating. Doesn't look like it. Yeah. Just making sure. Yep. Alright, nothing there. So we go down through this tunnel, and... Keep going down. You might recognize this area we were here earlier. I think we gotta go... Yeah, see, we do not want to go to that intersection just yet. Because I think that's a pretty crazy battle that we're not ready for. So we gotta go to the right this way. I think. Uh, yeah. Alright, so we're thrown into the next battle of the game. Uh, looks like more or less the same type of enemies we've already encountered. We got golems. Did we encounter them yet? I don't even remember. Attack 35. Uh, attack 30. Yeah, so those golems have a lot of attack. And the other problem with this battle is it's a desert battle, so... We're gonna be moving very slow through the battlefield. 
So let's get started. But we got the Birdman, Luke, and Peter. So there's a lot of guys we can control now. See, already I'm... Oh, crap. I never healed the poison. <laughs> Oops. I know I forgot something. I never healed Chester's poison from the last battle. Probably would have been a smart idea. Oop. Do I have any antidotes? I doubt it. Nope. Oh crap, what did I do? Oh no! Oh crap, well that was a mistake. Oh, and he's poisoned too? God, I think I'm gonna want to do this battle over again. Wow, and I accidentally used the Dario's quick chicken. That was stupid. So I used one of the boost weapons accidentally. Oh, uh, you pressed the wrong button. Alright, we'll use a detox. Start wasting some of Sarah's magic I didn't want to waste as of yet. Well, at least she's getting some <laughs> experience. But yeah, that was a huge mistake. Not huge, but I guess not really a giant mistake because really a lot of the upgrade weapons is what I wanted to use on Dario to begin with anyways. So it's not like the end of the world. All right, the enemies cannot reach me either. Kiwi, let us use the power ring on... Uh, let's put it on Slade. Attack by seven. Not bad, and the ring still didn't break. All is well in the world. Alright, we can finally boost into action here, so let's get started. By having Jaha attack the Death Archer. Alright, and now we get to see Luke in action as well. Um... I think I'm going to attack the Master Mage with him. So, nothing too amazing. Like I said, he's just run-of-the-mill, middle-of-the-pack type guy. Uh, who do I want to attack? I will attack the Master Mage. Still alive. And here we go. After... Oh, crap. Yikes. Well, that was a mistake on my part. You can really see the difficulty is starting to ramp up now in this game quite a bit. Alright, Chester. Um, equip. Oh, he's good. He already has it equipped. Let's finish off the Master Mage. Who did massive damage that time around. And Chester leveled up. So that's good. Already level 16. And takes two damage because of the lovely poison. That's, that's okay. So they're going after the main character. I'm okay with them doing that because he has a massive amount of health. And here we go. Now he's healing. Oh hey boy. <laughs> I could really use another healer right about now. Okay, Slade. Um... Uh, I will go after Black Monk. And the miss, of course. Even though Slade, I used the thing to boost his... That sucks. This is not good. So much for the uh, attack boost. Alright, Peter goes. We'll attack... Uh... This Death Archer. Nice critical hit. And level up. So like I said, I'm really kind of underleveled for at this point in the game. Um, I think Slade can probably use the heal the most right now. Oh, not that one. The heal level one. Just because he's the squishiest, so one other hit and he's probably be dead. I can't take that chance, and May can't do nothing. Uh, 
And of course, the zombie goes after who else? May. And poisoned her. Great. This is not going too well. <laughs> and uh, good thing I healed Slade because going after Slade. Yikes. All right, we need to get Kiwi involved here a little bit as well. With this pathetic 7 damage. But he did level up. Okay. Um, definitely, definitely going to get Kazen to do a Blaze level 2 here. Because we are being ganged up by a million enemies. Oh my god, really? He has one health left. Oh, crap. Okay, need to start killing some of these guys now. Oh my god. And a heal. Chester can't reach anybody, so let's equip the... Actually, do you have... You know, I keep forgetting to buy medical herbs, too. Alright, let's, uh... Hmm. Let's try and take out the evil cloud. There you go. Okay, at least we took him out. And more damage. Great. Good job. Booger Halt with the nice attack there. And let's see if Luke can finish off the zombie. Okay. I'm definitely gonna go for... Eh. Yeah, we'll go for the Death Archer, even though he only has... Eh. Yeah, I can't risk it. Because if he has the next turn, he might end up killing one of my characters. I don't want to take that chance. Plus, everybody's kind of underleveled, so they can all really use the experience. Alright, Slade. And a second attack. Very nice. And he's going to take more damage because of the poison, right? No, he's not poisoned. Yeah, like I said, the only problem with this battlefield is that it's so massive. Okay, this might be kind of a mistake, but I'm going to go kind of full-fledged with Peter. No, no second attack. All right. May. She's the one that's poisoned. Uh-oh. And a second at Oh my god. This is not good. <sighs> Can't even reach. What in the world am I going to do? I really hope... Hmm. I hope you take out the golem this round. Nope. Too much defense. No bueno. No bueno. Oh, wait a minute. I might be okay. As long as the zombie doesn't go again, I think I'll be alright. Nope. He's dead. Oh, wow. Wow, I got so lucky. 
Wow. Good job, Peter. I had one health left, and he dodged it. Unbelievable. That is such, such luck. You have no idea. God, everyone's poisoned. <laughs> oh, man. Well, I'll tell you one thing. Sarah is definitely getting a lot of healing done. Uh... Yeah, how about you just get the hell out of the way? <laughs> All right, um, let's go ahead and use the power ring on... Let's use it on Luke. Because he seems to have the best movement right now. And um, everyone else is struggling. And the ring still didn't break. All right, Kazen. Zombies are weak against fire. Dang, man. I mean, it probably wouldn't be the worst idea right now to egress out of here and then just kind of level up. A little bit, but um, that's all right. I mean, I don't really like using egress too much because I feel like it breaks the game if you become too strong. So let's just kind of leave at that for now. More damage because of poison. And here comes the archer. After you guessed it. I think I might have mentioned that already that this, uh, the lands, the desert lands is unforgiving with the movement speed. Look, May can't even get to anybody. Either could Gerholt. Okay, this is an easy, uh, decision. Definitely heal, uh, Peter. Okay, he actually needs almost two full heals. And the Tox got the level two, that's cool. Alright, Peter is good. And he gets two attacks, that's his, him angry. <laughs> that's funny. Alright, um... We'll use the power ring on... Jaha. Wow. Oh, there's the crack. A crack appeared in the power ring, so we can't use it anymore during this fight. It is much too dangerous. Taking it a little bit slow and trying to allow some of my characters to catch up here. Alright. Slade in the action. He moves, he seems to move pretty uh, pretty good too in the desert land. So he's actually playing a really important factor in this fight. Okay, Chester, you need a heal. So I've already used so much magic. Okay. Uh, you're still not 100%. We'll go ahead and just attack the zombie. And, uh, didn't kill him. Here they come. May still can't do anything. What a scrub.
I'm gonna go ahead and throw a, a blaze on the golem, even though uh, it's probably a risky move because of Kazen's health, but sometimes you gotta take risks here and there. Um... What should I do here? Yeah, we'll we'll take out the golem, or <laughs> I guess not take him out. Reduce his health a little bit. Now we'll take him out. Okay, so far so good. Esther still can't do anything. Luke. Luke with the killing blue. Level 15. Oh boy, and I just realized my remote control is about to die. I need new batteries. Alright. Slade. Kind of want to still keep Peter. Um. I don't know. I'm trying to still kind of keep him somewhat near Sarah because he can really use another heal. And here comes... Oh, that's what I was afraid of. The Black Monk. Oh, Jesus. Oh. The good news is I have at least one more heal left for Sarah after this. And now the zombie's going after Slade. My weaklings. They've been doing so much, but the problem is uh, they have no defense whatsoever. Kiwi still can't do nothing. Um, who should I go after? The zombie or the black monk? Go after the black monk. Wow, nice critical hit. Okay. Let's see if Kazen can finish off the Black Monk. Nope. Two health left. Okay. Um... Yeah. We'll, get, we'll give Luke the killing blow. Mario can't do shit. All right. Like I said before, it's just it wouldn't be so bad if the movement wasn't so limited. Even Slade is gonna die. <laughs> Alright, Peter. Nice crit. I have been getting a lot of critical hits this, this fight. Right after the main character. And another guy poisoned, add him to the list. Oi. Alright. This is easy. Kazen needs a heal. That's it for all the magic. Now they gotta endure the rest of the fight. And that's what I get. For not buying any medical herbs. May is worth- they're all worthless. All worthless. None of them could reach. There. Yikes. That poison is rough. Alright. You guys need to do some catching up. Look at this. You can only move, like, two steps in the desert. And she... Well, she does have a medical herb left. What did I do? 
Oh my god. That is the second time this fight that I accidentally use a weapon that I didn't mean to use. Oh my god. Oh. Whatever. What the hell? Now I accidentally used the healing drop. <laughs> wow. Anyways. Nice dodge. Nice dodge. Wow, that's it? Oof. I don't like that he's so low on health. Everybody's poisoned. Oh my goodness. Alright, Peter. Oh my god, how much defense do these guys have? There he goes, after Jaha. That's actually who I wanted him to go with, because Jaha has like... Probably one of the best defenses. So if they're gonna go for any characters, that's the ones I did want them to go after. Okay. Let us not make the same mistake again. I wanted to use the medical herb. Okay, I need to... Get up there quick. Quick, quick. And another enemy. This one's going after Luke. Can't reach. Okay. Um, go after this golem. We'll finish off that golem. All right, almost done. Will this be enough to finish him? No, it's not. Close. Um. Oh crap. Main character. Oh god. One health. One freaking health. Wow. I barely survived that. All right. <sighs> And another dodge. May do nothing. Kiwi do nothing. Here he comes. And Slate is dead, I think. Nope. He survived. Okay, you do nothing. Alright. We might... We might be alright here. I mean, at least my, my casters, my mage, and my priest, I managed to deplete pretty much all of their magic in this fight. And Jaha with the killing blow, we did it. 17, level 17. Okay, that was rough. Wow. That was rough. Alright. Uh, we came to this, but sorry, I should have said what I was doing. So we crossed the desert, we came to this little cave here, cave over here. And with that, that's a good place to stop the video. Oh my goodness. So, we didn't lose any characters. There's still characters that are poisoned. Um, so I'm, actually, I should probably go back to town and uh, detox everybody. But as you can see, I'm getting really close to promotion level, Dario sick level 16, Sarah 13, which she needs help 
Um, everyone else looks like 15. So Kiwi 13. Yeah, so there's... It would probably be in my best interest to level up a little bit. But I'm not sure yet if I will or not. We'll see. Anyways, this is a good stopping point. Thank you guys for watching. We'll see you next time for more Let's Play Through Shiny Force 2. Thank you. Bye.